With the election rapidly approaching, the DPP is paying particular attention to at-large legislative seats as it worries smaller political parties could erode its support base. This means the DPP's original safe list may no longer include the 15th and 16th nominee. The DPP held a press conference today to encourage voters to support it with their party vote to ensure a DPP majority in the legislature. The DPP sought more exposure for its at-large legislative nominees as it worried minor political parties may be taking votes away from the DPP. The party is feeling a sense of urgency as it called for the public to choose the DPP with the party vote. If we are unable to elect Zhong Kong Zhao and then Jing Yi to the legislature, our reform movement will be compromised. We sincerely urge you to support our cause. The DPP had originally set its safe list of at-large nominees at 16, but current conditions indicate that the 15th and 16th nominee may no longer be safe, such as Zhong Kong Zhao, who is both a labor and Hakka activist, as well as Lin Qing Yi, an activist for women's rights. Even incumbent at-large nominees at the 13th and 14th position, Yo Mei Nu and Li Ying Yuan, are feeling the pressure and called a press conference to appeal to voters. With the election entering its final countdown, the DPP is firing up its support base in a last-ditch effort to win more of the party vote for at-large legislative seats.